This isn't that difficult. Domino wants me. So let him have me. Put me on the streets. Use me as bait. I don't care. It's gone too far. But... You're making big headlines, Frisco. And it is election time. The DA is no. not going to let you slip away. Well, just what the hell are we supposed to do? Call for me, sir? Yes, I have a job for you, officer. You're going to look after how alleged perp here. What? Commissioner, I just got out of special SWAT team training school, and you want me to be a bodyguard? Well, it's a messy job, but someone's got to do it. I haven't even been arraigned yet, right? I might get out on bail. Let's get real, shall we? If Claudio dies, you face first-degree manslaughter. Even if he doesn't, from what I hear, the DA is going to throw the book at you for everything from assault to piracy. You can help me, and you know it. I have helped you. I kept you alive, haven't I? Scorpio. Yeah. We're on our way. Thank you. Officer, collect your charge. We're all going to gather in the courtroom. The arraignment's being held this morning. Does that mean the clock? No, no, no. Frisco's being arraigned on all the other charges. Oh, thank goodness. Oh, they're bad enough. If Claudia dies, they're going to add manslaughter. It's just not fair. Frisco is just trying to catch Domino and his thugs, and now he's the one in jail, and they're out there still playing their games. What's this? What's this doing here? Robert was looking at it. Domino's calling card. Why is it here? Frisco was given it last night. We think it was one of Domino's men dressed up as a guard. Probably trying to make Frisco escape. Oh, he can't do that. No, I know. We've talked to him about it. He knows. Well, he's so well trained. If he, if he tried to escape, he could do it very successfully. Maybe you should talk to him. Yeah. I'll do whatever I can. I'm sure Colton won't mind about it. Such a difficult situation for you, Beth. No, no, we can handle it. It's a shame that you two should have to suffer for what Frisco's doing. Yeah. I've been thinking about that a lot, but something's very strange. He's really changed. He's not as angry as he used to be. Most men would be. It's, it's very confusing. He's just so calm and so relaxed. He says everything's going to be fine. I guess I should just be happy that Colton's not a part of the problem anymore. It's great. You two probably have a lot to discuss. So I'll just come back in a little while. I have to move the stuff out of your cell anyway. What do you mean? Robert's orders. He wants you kept in isolation. He's putting me in solitary confinement? I'm sorry, Frisco. Well, what the hell? Might as well. So far today, I've been indicted on charges that could put me away for about 150 years. Now Scorpio's gonna put me in solitary confinement. Don't tell me. L let me guess. You're here because you've decided to sign the divorce papers now. Is that it? Is that why you're here? No. No. I, I heard about the domino and I was worried about you. Oh. Well, there's no need to worry. I'm going to be in a small cell all by myself, very well guarded. If you go up against domino, you'll be playing into his hands. I can't go up against domino. They got me put away. I can't get my hands on him. Every cop in Port Charles will have their gun drawn sitting outside. They're also trying to protect you from him. Please, just, just trust Robert and Anna. I don't want to see anything happen to you. Why are you here? I want you to get hurt. That's not it. That's not the reason you're here. You're afraid, aren't you? You're afraid to let me get close to you because you won't be able to handle the feelings you'll have. Please, just trust Robert. I want you to be safe. 
Well, he's got Sam guarding me. He knows I'm not going to do anything to her to get out of here. Well, then I owe her a favor. We all do, for you. Will you do me a favor? Will you stay here till she comes back? It's very lonely in solitary confinement. And I'd just like to look at you and memorize what I'm seeing. I'll need it. I could do that. That's all right. I, I was just here to make sure that everything was all right. That a man broke it's all into. Right. I understand that things went pretty badly for you at the arraignment this morning, and I wanted to say that I'm sorry. You're sorry? Yes. I'm sorry for all of us. This has been very difficult for Felicia and me, but that's no excuse. For us to be adding to the problems you already have. But our problems will be over soon. Frisco, we gotta go. Company. I actually came to talk with Anna and Robert, Felicia, if you don't mind. Do you want me to go? Yes. For now. I'll be home a little bit later and we can talk then. I don't have to work until tonight. No. Two nights in a row? I'll tell you what, I'm going to try and get tomorrow night off, okay? I'll talk to you later. card you need. Jen. Let's see. The total when we were cadets, what I've won today, you owe me about seven million bucks. Yes, you see, that is my strategy, to lose big. I mean, come on, if I only owed you a meager 75 cents, you'd make me pay up and then you'd go off and find another card game with a better card player. Well... Under the current circumstances, that's not a possibility. I'm really sorry, Frisco. Now, we're going to do about it now, huh? I wish we were on the same side of these bars. I think the commissioner forgot how close we were when we were on the force. I don't know why he's letting me guard you. After all, we are friends. That's exactly why you're guarding me. Because it knows I'd never do anything to hurt you to get out of here. I know. Cut the cards, Kappa. <sighs> it's my lucky hand. I can feel it. Don't count on it. 